Hello and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Monday. My name is Wizzy Zier, and I'll call me Wizzy. And today, we're going to be playing some more hardcore Minecraft. Now, in the last episode, we did um, level up the um, cartographer um, and found out that he does not offer the um, trial chamber map. So we're going to have to work on getting another cartographer going. And I did end the video by cleaning this up. We'll move the sugar cane over to here, probably at the end of the video. And what else do we do? Honestly, I don't remember what else we did. But first things first, um, what we're going to do is we're going to make another cartography table. I believe it's two paper and four wood, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. Okay, so we get a new cartography table. Let's bring the emeralds. Um, bring the paper that I have with me. And... You know what? Let's take the sugar cane down, or part of the sugar cane down. Actually, you know what? We'll take it all down. Uh, no. Not yet. That way, some of it can still grow. Make sure I grabbed all of it. Okay, and I know there was two in the chest in here. There we go. Okay. So let's go place another cartography table down. And to get another cartographer and hope that they offer the map as well. Or this time. So are there any other villagers over here that are unemployed? Well, this guy's gonna be coming unemployed. Sorry, buddy, but you are gonna become a cartographer. Okay, so don't really want to trade for an empty map. I mean, I could, but we're not gonna do that. In fact, what am I do no. I need to fill this in. So, you know what? Let's go grab some dirt. Let's do that really quick. Because I don't want any villagers to drop through there and perish. Actually, the question is, do I have any extra dirt? I'm starting to think I don't. <laughs> Excuse me. No. Got all kinds of glass panes in there, so when we get to that point... Um... You know what I will do right now, though? Let's put the emeralds back. I will actually do... That should be more than enough. Move the sugar cane over. Oh, there's another piece of sugar cane there that I missed. Okay, so I have a little over a half a stack of sugar cane. So I'll plant all of what I have currently. Buckets. Let me. Do I have any extra buckets? Let's see. I do. 
Um, I only need one extra. Okay, so now... Let's do this. I'm going to make all the spots for the sugar cane that I want right now. Um, of course, I won't be able to place all of them at the moment. Not until they grow, at least. Oops, that is not what I wanted to do. But at least once they do grow, I will have the spaces or place for them. Or like I said, spaces for them, rather, I guess. What I'm doing is enough for 64 sugarcane, which will give me two stacks each time. Well, if they're both fully grown, or if they're all fully grown, that is. Okay, so that's all set. I got some extra dirt now, but I'm just going to kind of use it to fix that a little bit. Okay, so let's go put some of this stuff away. Okay, so now I'm not entirely sure what I want to do at the moment. I think actually what I kind of want to do is I want to get some librarians leveled up. Or get some librarians, rather. Or maybe not necessarily the librarians, but get the, um... I want to do some enchanting stuff, actually. But I want to wait for the night to be able to sleep first. So let me grab these, grab some books, some lapis, at least try and get some basic enchantments on some of this first. Projectile projection 2. Although I should probably try and get some bookshelves in here so I can try and get better enchants, but... Yeah. 
So I'm actually going to wait on that then. Um, so let's try and level up some of the other villagers then. Okay. At least the armor and weapon villagers. That way we can see what sort of enchanted armor they give. So everybody's over here. So you're the weaponsmith. Um, don't know. Okay, so you're the cartography we ex did earlier. See, I don't know if I want to do the Woodland Explorer map. If I'm going to be honest. I mean, having the extra lives or whatever, I guess, would be good, but... Toolsmith. Weaponsmith. Photographer. Fletcher. Actually, you know what, let me see what I can get on my bow, maybe, I guess. I really do want to try and get that other um, cartographer leveled up, though. Power one... If we had infinity, that would be good. You know what? I can always try and level up the, um... The Fletcher. Let me get some bamboo. Okay. Yeah, I played a little bit of my off-camera hardcore survival, and I have yet to find any bamboo. Like, I've looked... Um, well, not everywhere, obviously, but I've gone quite a ways away from my um, base. And have been un unable to find any bamboo. Getting bamboo, especially early, is um, pretty big. So let's go over to the Fletcher. Because I know he will offer enchanted bows as well. See, I don't have any string, unfortunately. I don't want to just keep getting crossbows, because I don't have a whole bunch of crossbows with uh, no use for them, basically. Um... Maybe I should get these guys into armors, or at least librarians, or whatever. I 
Maybe I should do that. Make them librarians instead of armorers and toolsmiths. I do have this oh, silk shot touch, that's right. Um, so let's see, slabs, I think. Actually, let's see. Flower charge banner pattern. Interesting. Oh, I need an actual bookshelf. Okay, you know what? That's fine. So I can only make one of them into a librarian then. But that's fine. Actually, you know what I'll do? Uh, let me grab some... I was gonna make a cow farm as well. Um, okay. Grab some oak fences, that way they can at least kind of keep him in an area. So they're all going over there. So let me do this actually. Um, need to do this with a path, but And one of them should wander over here to become a librarian. Maybe. Actually, I may not do it yet. Um, I'm gonna move this one over to here for now. That way, when it becomes uh, day again... They'll, be, they'll come into there. So see, there's two cows here already. Um, you know, I'll use these two cows to... Breed and make the cow farm with these guys. Don't want to use my sword, waste durability on my sword if I do that. Nope, oh, no, 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 no. No, go back over here. Shoot. Well. It's not good. I need to get some wheat. So maybe what I'll do is I'll go back over to my house, sleep there, get some wheat. Not what I wanted to do, but whatever.
Do I have any wheat in here already or no? Uh, it may not be in that chest. It might be in here? Nope. That's fine. There's wheat out here, so... Actually, let me put the saplings away. Put those two away. Turn that into wood. Okay. And now I have a couple wheat. Let's see if I can get that one cow back into the pen there. Gone all the way up here. Okay, come here, cow. Come here. That's right, come back this way. Oh, there's another cow over here, too. I'll breed you two. I don't have any other wheat on me. So everybody's going to their jobs now. We already get the one librarian over here now. Okay, Frostwalker is not what we're looking for. Nope. Nope. I know there's an easier way to do this. Um, nope. Loyalty three, no. You're gonna become a librarian? Go on. Seriously? Well, um, I guess what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to keep him in the corner, kind of, I guess. So, trap doors. There we go. Good that you're already there, but um, okay, are you able to go into that corner there or no? There. Okay, so now you're in the corner, you can't move. That will make this a lot easier. Come on. No, I'm not asking you to become a librarian. Although, I suppose if you want to. Um, let's do this.
there. Fortune 3. Uh, I already got a Fortune 3, and plus the price of that is a bit steep, my friend. Sharpness 5. Uh, I don't have any of the books either. Efficiency 4. Kind of expensive once again. Looting 3. Mending. I mean, that's not bad, but kind of expensive once again. Look of the sea. No enchantments. I mean, Prot would be good. Okay, there's the infinity. Um, do I want to do that though, right on, just for the one enchantment? You know what, no. Density three. Multi-shot. No. Fire aspect. Power five. I mean, that's nice, but not really what we're looking for. Feather falling, I think. Okay, so I need to bring up. Um, no, we're gonna pause it for a moment. I want to bring up my spreadsheet that I made for the trading. Because I feel like. Was that the highest that went was for Feather Falling? Was that Feather Falling 3? Um, feather Falling 4 is actually the highest you can go. And how much is he selling that for? 39? Eh. I'd almost rather get something else. Zen City 4. You know what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go grab some or grab a book. That way I can lock him in when we finally get an enchantment. I believe I already have one leather over here. I just need some paper, which is not going to be an issue, obviously. In fact, I'm going to plant some of this sugar cane here while I'm at it. I think I ha already had a couple sugar cane in my chest. Let's see. I did not. Okay, so leather. Let's put the seeds away while I'm at it. You know, a couple more sugar kangaroos, so that's good. Okay, now we have ourselves a book, the emeralds. So we're all set for once we get a trade that we want to get. 
So I'm going to place my bed up over here as well. That way when the night uh, sets or starts or whatever, I can sleep and then we can start doing the cycling all over again. That is not where I wanted to place that. Okay. Efficiency 5, but for 64 is a no-go. Density 1. Feather Falling 2, if it was 3, it might have been worth it. Efficiency 4. Not what we're looking for. Riptide. Looting. Fire prop 4. I mean, that is very tempting, but for 51? I don't think so. Multi shot. Impaling five. Fire aspect one. Projectile protection four for twenty five. Now that one is actually kind of tempting. Um. Let me see. So, projectile protection reduces damage, obviously, from projectiles. Um, you know, I, I want to look for just straight up protection. Feather falling two. Or feather falling three or four. Mending for 34, I'd say no. If it was a bit cheaper. I mean, yes, we could be at this for a little bit, but Breach 2. Loyalty 2. Knockback 2. Bane of Anthrop or Arthropods, three. Unbreaking, one. Respiration, three. Absolutely nothing. Sweeping Edge, three. Knockback, one. Knock back one again. Infinity for 11. I mean, not bad, but... Once again, basically, I'd be using it for the one enchant. And I want to be able to get more than just the one use out of... Or get one book from him. And of Arthropods... Mending. Ooh, for 16 as well. Um, see, does mending work with... It's compatible with infinity. I mean, that's fine.
You know what? I might do that. Um, because I can put mending on all of my tools. I can put mending on my armor. So, you know what? I think we're going to do that one. We're going to lock that one in. Of course, I only had the one book. Okay, so you are now free to move around. We're going to leave that there. Oops. I'm going to have to work on getting another lectern to get another... Another, um... Actually, I can do that to get the bookshelf from him. And I can make a lectern with that. And I can try and get another uh, librarian going. Um, so yeah, let's do this. Let me put a slab here, and then when the new unemployed villager comes over, if another new unemployed villager comes over at some point, because I know there was one, um... Now it's raining. Because there was that one guy that was trying to become the librarian when I was trying to get him to become a librarian. Um, well, that's a problem. No, 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 not you. Come on. Not you, cow. Or baby cow. No. Nope. You dum dums. Come on. Not you, cow. No, not you. Oh, this is a pain. Okay, let me do this, actually. Let me cordon off the cows. One, one at a time. Come on, guys. Okay. That was more difficult than it needed to be. <laughs> Got these two chatting over here. And now I think because... It's the end of the workday. None of the new unemployed villagers are going to come over. So 
So I may have to wait for it to become day again. So in the meantime, what I want to do is I might get some more wheat. <laughs> um, and get some more cows. Get some more uh, fence posts as well. Okay, that should be more than enough. I don't think I have any leads, unfortunately. Because if I did, that would make things a whole lot easier with the cows. Um, get a fence gate. paper and grab that one piece of leather from my that I have and make another book that way I can I can lock in the trade for this other librarian when I get a trade that I'm looking for. Okay, so we're gonna do that there. Um, Actually, could have just left the paper in there, but whatever. Um, sugarcane, wheat seeds, saplings can all stay in there. So let's go try and get some trades from this other librarian who's probably there by now. Or if not, will be coming over shortly. Take the bed out for the moment. Let me move the lectern. Okay, we got this unemployed guy just standing around doing nothing. And where did this other unemployed guy go? Well, we do have this villager in here. Or librarian, rather. Um, and his trades had reset, it looked like. Are you... Okay. No, you aren't. It's 
this the same librarian or is this a different librarian now? That's the same librarian and you're stuck because of the stupid design of these places. Okay, here we go. Nope, 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 you dumb dumb. Yeah, go back in here. No, you... Okay. Go into here. There we go. Okay. You're gonna stay right there. Until we get a trade that we're looking for. Den City, no. Fire Prot 4. Um, I'd rather not. Fire Prot 3. Respiration 2. Unbreaking 1. Protection would be really nice to get. Knock back one. Frostwalker one. Silk touch, we already have one that. Sharpness one. Thorns 2. Multi shot. Fire aspect. Sharpness 3. What I'm going to do actually is I'm going to put a fence post there to make it a little bit easier to do this. Um, Curse of Vanishing, no. Riptide 2. Piercing. What, can I put... Can I do this? Will you... No, you won't. Okay. It was worth a shot. Mending. We already have mending. Feather falling three for 37. Now, once again, if that was a little bit cheaper, then I would go for it. Projectile protection two. Axe is about to run out. Punch one. Frostwalker two. Looting two. Pain of Arthropods four. My axe did run out. Flame. Okay, so let's go make a new axe. And I need to get, actually get food there. That's fine. Plant that seed while we're there. <clears throat> or sapling, rather. I could have just done this over here. I thought I had more diamonds than I do, but apparently not. So... Let's go back. Let's 
And I hate that this is taking the entire video for va this, basically, but whatever. Okay, so flame. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing again. Power four. Sharpness four. Nothing. Nothing again. Nothing again. Protection one. Okay. Flame. Mending. For 24. I think that... Actually, how much are we getting for mending from the other guy? I don't know. But anyways, looting three. Blast protection two. Frostwalker two. Bane of Arthropods five. Protection two. You get in there. Piercing two. Uh, I need to put the bed down. Nothing. Nothing. up the bed that way because I don't really need it there infinity once again nothing aqua affinity multi shot efficiency three for 21 I mean not bad, but still not what we're looking for. Loyalty one, which this guy has none of. I'm just joking. Punch two. Channeling. Nothing once again. Fire prop 4 for 26. I mean... Power 4. Mending again. Last prop one. Nothing. Efficiency one. Yo, how much? Sixteen. Okay, so yeah, we had a good deal. Infinity. Fire prot three. Loyalty three. Looting three. Nothing. Unbreaking two. Fortune two. Lock of the Sea 2. We're getting like everything 
other than what we're looking for. Of course. I mean, isn't that how it works? Fire proc 2. See, the thing is, I have my sheet here up, right? And it shows the weights of all of these things. Protection is weighted at 10. Which means it should show up more than what it is. Punch 2. I mean, we've had punch several times. And that's only weighted at 2. And we've had it more times than protection. Curse of Binding. Impaling. Now he's not offering anything. Piercing 2. Again. We're closing in on the one hour mark. Fortune 3. Give me like Prot 3 at least. Or... Feather Falling 3, or 2. Actually, was it? What's the... Feather Falling 3. Yeah. So either Prot 3 at least, or Feather Falling 3 at least. But not so expensive where I don't want to get it at that price. Projectile Protection. Reach 1. I swear, if I get, like, Protection 3 and it's like 64 emeralds, I'm going to lose it. Or Protection 4 and it's 64. Mending. For 14, I think that's actually cheaper than the other guy now. Efficiency 3. Piercing 1. Piercing 4. Aqua Affinity. Sharpness 1. Feather Falling 4, but it's for 46 emeralds. And that's what I was just kind of saying. I mean, it's what I'm looking for, but it's too expensive. Power 4, that was for 20. Aqua Affinity. Nothing. Nothing again. Nothing again. Quick charge one. Oops, shoot. Did not mean to do that. Now the prices are going to be high for a bit, which is rather unfortunate. Channeling. At least they will come down at some point. I mean, it does come down over time. Vein of Arthropods. Reach 3. 
Aqua Affinity. Silk Touch, and we're over an hour now. I mean, honestly, that's what he gets for having us do these sorts of things for the entire episode, pretty much. But, it is what it is, I guess. Affinity. I mean, honestly, this is probably why nobody's watching to this point. For past 30 seconds. Up Strider. Although, to be fair, the um, Super Mario Party Saturday, I did get a few actual views now, which was exciting. I mean, it's a new series, so I kind of expect it to get at least some views. Feather Volling 4 for 18. But right now, 23. Which is still a lot better, even with the upscale, or the up mark price or whatever, markup price. Um, still cheaper than what it was before. So we'll do that. <clears throat> and um, yeah, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to move your lectern to over here. And now you can roam free. Now I know they will, if you level them up enough, they will offer more enchantments as well. Um, but, yeah. Anyways, so let's head back over here. I think next episode what I'll do is I'll move the cows over to here. In fact, what I can do right now is put the fence gates, or fence down for the farm. Let me just place the bed down right here. Okay, so, um, let's see. Actually, you know what? Let's do it this way. And I can move these over one. And I'll put, like, the fence gate here. There, that works. And then this can be where the cows can go into. Uh, so, like I said, next episode we'll work on moving the cows into here. Um, get the cow farm going. Um, yeah. And then we can start getting more leather and more um, beef or whatever. Um, steaks or whatever for um, our food uh, source. But mostly for the leather. But anyways, um, so this week I'm planning on doing the Roblox Step for County Railway video. Next Monday, more Minecraft, and then ne the following Saturday, Super Mario Saturday. But anyways, that's just about going to do it for this video, though, so hopefully you've all enjoyed. If you did, please make sure you leave a thumbs up. And of course, as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye!